so I'm starting over. My camera is doing some whole extra stuff for some reason. But anyway, um, hello guys. I'm back again. And this time, I'm just here to give you guys a follow-up and a quick, I'm going to do a super duper quick tutorial on twists. Um, that, first of all, a lot of people asked me, uh, how long did my Bantu knot twist out last? It lasted three days. Um, it just got fluffier and fluffier each time. And overnight, what you do is you take big chunks of it. You don't brush it out. You don't finger comb it. You just twist those twists back together again and Bantu knot them or Yui them. Um, and then each time they just come out more fabulous and more fabulous, but fuller and fuller. Um, I do have pics I will post at the end of this video. Um, overnight, I decided to just, you know, do some small twists. Not many twists at all, but they are small just to get my hair out of the way. And uh, I have to give a shout out to my homegirl, Lakeisha Collins. These are her beauties that she made. Um, she, a Hand in Hand Creations. Dot com is the website where you can get fabulous earrings. Like, let me see if she can, if she'll do a giveaway for me. She might um, do a giveaway, but that would be awesomeness. But <laughs> I'm gonna talk to her. That's my best friend. Um, but these are fan fabulous earrings, color blocking, just beautiful. I just love them. They, you see the craftiness in them, in the colors and everything. But these are fabulous. I'll have her information for her website um, in the information box below and um, you guys can check her out for yourself. She has these and so much more. I have tons of her earrings and I will definitely shout her out every time I have them on. So let's get started. I have these twists in my head and to do these twists I actually used um, it's a new product. My mom turned me on to it. It's at, by African Pride and it's, it's some kind of butter or something. I don't know the exact name I'm going to call mom tonight and ask her exactly and I'll put the information into the information box um, once I get the info from her. But I've already sprayed them this morning so I'm not going to spray again. But you know guys what I usually do is spray my hair. I sprayed them this morning. So sometimes you just have it. to mess with your hair and figure out the rest later because that is what I do. So yeah I do want to side swoop. So what we're going to do is take these braids here. Take this section. You see I'm taking a section of it. I want to take a big section too. I think I'll take that big one too. And then you twist like that. Okay, then we're gonna twist it one more time. And then I'm gonna go like that. And we're gonna take hairpin. And we're just gonna pin it into place. I probably should use a big one. Okay. And we're just pinning that into place over there. Here's another one. Pin until you feel secure. That's what I believe. If you don't, if you don't think that thing's gonna hold, don't you, don't you dare. Okay, this side. Mm, do I want to? Yeah, let's do that. We'll take these, and we're gonna go forward like this. And what we're doing. It's just twisting, 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 twisting. I'm going all the way back, twisting, 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 twisting. And then we're going to take this side and we're going to join. Twisting, twisting. Oh gosh. I hope I'm showing this to you guys, right? Because I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just doing something right now. But that's how you get styles. Like, if you don't try stuff, you don't even know what you can do with your hair. And I tell people this all the time. It's like mad important that you just mess with your hair. Because the word on the street is that 4C naturals can't really do much with their hair. And that's not true. So not true. Alright, so what I'm going to do at the back is just, I just want the bun today. I don't want anything more than that, so I'm going to take the hair at the back that I put into a ponytail and just turn it under, protecting my ends. And I'm going to take this big 
goodie band, elastic band, which I love, and I'm going to do that. So, it's a little funky band type thing. I need to tuck these in. Nothing serious, nothing over the top, nothing, you know, this is just, I'm kicking it. You guys already know that I work from home. So I ain't going nowhere. So it's really not something for me to take incredibly serious um, this morning, Monday morning. Make sure those ends are tucked. Protecting the ends, I see now, is so, you can do it by just twisting your nap, your own hair. A lot of people think that the best protective style is braids or something like that. I'm trying to get that to lay down. And um, it's not actually, I mean, it works. Trust me, because I've done yarn braids. I don't know. I love yarn braids. I love that, that dreadlock look. But anyway, um, yeah, it, it it's you can do um, protective styles with your own hair, which since I've been doing it, my hair has grown by leaps and bounds. So I usually do twists and do updos. But this is the finished product, guys. Once again, um, of course, you can gel the back. Um, your edges using once again the shine and jam silk edges I'm not using like um, eco styler because it's not that serious for me but honestly um, if I was trying to if it, if it was that serious and I was going out or something and I want them edges laid then I would use eco styler because Eco Styler holds much better than this. This is simply for your baby hairs. Just for baby hairs. Because it don't hold anything else down. Not for me. As a 4C, it doesn't do that much justice for like incredible hold but it will hold those baby hairs at the nape of your neck um and around your face it does that very well you have to reapply but it does that too and that's it guys you know um i think it's cute I think if I look to this side, bomb, you know, if I look to this side, bomb. So, yeah, it's cute. If you don't want to do yours that way and you just want it to let it hang, you could definitely do that. I just chose to pin everything up. Um, that was my preference for today. So, that is all for today, guys. Um, I just wanted, I really just wanted to get on camera to show you guys my earrings. Oh my girl, I love them. Look at them. They like, you know, if I was froze out today, like this is my favorite. Um, and it matches my shirt. Hey, stay it's tuned. Open. I have lots of stuff to share with you guys, and um, hopefully a giveaway by HandInHandCreations.com. Peace, love, blessings. Come.